Now, there's a very important principle. I want to keep this short and sweet. And I'm going to be a man of my word this video because I know I always say short and sweet and it ends up being like 18 minutes. So I'm still learning. I'm still evolving. I'm 21 years old. Okay, and I'm leading thousands of men, literally saving people from killing themselves. That is not only a lot of responsibility, which I completely bear and I embrace, and I'm very, very proud and, and grateful for that. It's part of being a masculine individual, right? But you also have to understand that I'm still learning too. I'm still evolving. My job here is not to be perfect. I don't come on the camera and I, I don't, I'm not, I'm not going to be arrogant enough to say like, oh yeah, I know everything. Everything that I say is always 100% correct. There's a lot of lessons you can learn from this. And I'm going to start from the first one is number one, you must understand that because I'm still learning, my job is to go out there into the real world, to live, to make mistakes, to fail, to succeed, and then to self-analyze, to self-reflect, and then come back to you as my bro, as my little bro, as my mate, whatever, my best mate, and come and teach you what I've learned so you don't have to make the same mistakes. You can save yourself time. That is literally my job. That's the point of what I'm doing here. It's to go out there into the real world, live, fail, get fucking smacked on my ass, get back up and learn from it. Hmm, why did that happen? Ah, oh, okay, because of this. Now I can come on the camera and I can teach you. But that does not mean that what I currently think is correct, what I currently think works, will always work or will work for you. Maybe it'll work for me for the rest of my life, but it might not work for you and your personality, your circumstances, your upbringing, etc., your home life. So the main lesson I want to, keep, to, to kind of inspire into you is to, number one, be very, very cautious with which information you choose to make your beliefs because your beliefs ultimately become your reality. So really sit and contemplate things before you decide, yes, this is what I'm going to believe. Don't just blindly follow because, oh, Luke said it and Luke's in a position of success and Luke, ha Luke gets girls and all this kind of... Don't do that. Don't be so naive to only see the external success and believe that everything in my life is perfect and everything in my life is, is okay because, oh, I must have it all right then because I get girls or because I've got thousands of subs on YouTube. Like, don't see it like that. Don't just blindly follow. Contemplate for yourself. It might not work for you. So... Not only am I still growing and learning, so obviously don't take anything that I say with complete conviction and complete certainty as, ah, this is the exact way to do things. There is no set way of living life. There is no set way that you should experience this one beautiful life that you have. That is completely up to you to decide. For example, for me, I recommend young men go through a bit of a playboy phase when they're young and they go and experiment and get confidence and, and practice and experience with girls so that when they do meet a girl that they genuinely really fall in love with, they're better equipped at just being confident in themselves and not fucking things up. Now, that might not work for you. Maybe you're religious. It's not going to work for you, is it? No sex before marriage, right? So that's fine. So everything that I say, I want you to take with a grain of salt, analyze it, decide whether or not this will work for you, decide whether or not this will positively impact your life, and then implement it. If something that I says doesn't affect you in a positive way, doesn't really do anything for you, it's kind of like, yeah, that wouldn't really work for me. Acknowledge it, respect my opinion, and move on. Life is just about experience. Life is about just doing things, trying things, and then defining what you want the purpose of life to be for yourself. That's what life's all about. It's not to blindly follow. It's not to find somebody that you want to be like and just, and just copy them. That's not what life is. Life is. You have one precious life yourself. This is your life to live. Do not waste it by blindly following because you're going to have to learn a lot of harsh lessons. It's going to hit you in the face one day and you're going to have like a realization, a paradigm shift where you think, oh my God, all of my old beliefs were wrong. Why were they wrong? Because you didn't take enough time to contemplate and decide whether or not they were actually the best for you. So all of the things that I'm saying to you, all of the advice that I give you, when I give you the advice at the current time that I record the video, I genuinely believe that is the best course of action. That is the best advice. That is genuinely what I believe when I record the video. Next week, I might believe something different. It's part of life. It's part of learning. It's part of growing. It's part of evolving. 10 years time, I hope, I hope to God I'm not the same person that I am today. I hope that I've grown tenfold. I hope that I have completely different beliefs. And fucking fly. And you should too. So just keep that in mind that all that you can do is make sure you operate fucking okay, hell, bruv, with the best knowledge that you have in the current moment. So as long as you can successfully look back at your past self and say, well, in that moment, I was just doing what I thought was best with the knowledge that I had. That's all that you can do. Take what I say, consider it, have it in the back of your mind, but don't blindly follow. 
Okay, I'm still learning too. Don't judge me. Don't be judgmental. Oh, well, you, Luke, you said this. So you, and now you're saying this. You must be a hypocrite. That's part of life. Of course, I'm going to change. Of course, I'm going to evolve. But as I do it, I'm just going to keep giving you advice, 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 advice. And you can pick out of all the, out, maybe an old video that I made months ago might work for you in your current position now. Or maybe a video that I make today might work for you in your current position now. Maybe in a week's time, a different video might work for you. So go through all my videos, pick and choose the advice, take the good that works for you in this current moment and discard the rest. Maybe in the future, the rest that you discarded might come in handy. But for now, just do what you need to do with the current knowledge that you have. Does that make sense? The coaching's down below. Look after yourself. I'll see you soon. Bam.